Hey guys, it's Muggy McGee, and we are back with some more FIFA 18. Full Head have actually predicted the ones to watch cards for FIFA 18, and there are some incredible ones, including Neymar, Usman Dembele, Salah, Bakioko, T. Libans. A very, very nice selection, as you can see here. We will scroll through all of them because they all look very, very nice. Before we get to the video, don't forget to smash the like button. If you enjoyed the FIFA 18 news and content that I am bringing to you, I get the game 10 hours from the 21st. So just five days away till I got some pack opening, some career modes and some more FIFA 18 content. So don't forget to stay tuned to my channel for that and leave in the comments down below if there's any big signings which you think should be a ones to watch card in FIFA 18 and perhaps Foothead haven't predicted so. But let's get into it. So they are back as you can see here. Hopefully they're going to be a bit better. And you get um, the ones to watch upgraded for team this year. Team this season. Man of the matches. There was a lot of conditions in uh, in as to why some players didn't even get upgraded last year. So it's pretty, pretty stupid. But EA actually tweeted out what a ones to watch looks like when they get them out of packs. And just look at it. Looks so so nice. Almost looks like an inform, but you have this new like arrows on the pack on the card, sorry. And look at that, just packing Neymar. Got your fireworks. And then he comes in his new PSG shirt. He is doing incredible in that league so far. He's just absolutely ripping them apart. Him and Mbappe and Cavani up front are just incredible. So obviously ones to watch will be available from September the 29th, the worldwide launch of the game EA um, will roll out 17 items on the 29th and to make the full list of 23 so I just can't wait these are the footwiz predictions though so we've got Neymar obviously now PSG five star skill is five star weak foot like that that would be incredible he's already 92 rated so his ones to watch card hopefully if he gets a team of the season I'm not sure if we get a team of the year but if he gets a team of the season then We'll be looking at like a 98 rated PSG Neymar. He's already got the 5 star skills and the 5 star weak foot. And he already has, already has 92 pace, 94 shooting and um, 84 shooting. Just incredible. Benucci is the next one who I did actually sort of review his base card in my Calcio, um, Calcio A predictions and ratings yesterday. But it looks a very nice card. He's already got an 88, so he's wants to watch card. Hopefully, again, if he gets a team of the season, will be 92, 93. Should be incredible. Lukaku made that big money move. Was it 90 million with all the add-ons to Manchester United? And his base card with 84 physical, 83 pace, and 85 shooting will be expensive. Like his base card and his wants to watch card will be extremely expensive. He's got four star. Hold on, let me zoom this in. He does have four star um, weak foot, only three star skills, which is a bit of a downer. But if he gets um, a team this season, again, he's going to be a 93 94, like he did last season when he tore the league up with Everton. Really, really nice card. Hamez has gone on loan, so he still gets a ones to watch card, even if he's gone on loan because he's there for two years, which is very nice on EA's part. He's gone to Bayern Munich, didn't really get the game time at Real Madrid, and Bayern Munich's just the perfect, perfect place for him, in my opinion. With 85 shooting and 85 passing on this base card, I can't wait for some of these ones to watch cards to be released. Like, I I used ones to watch Dembele when he was at Dortmund last year, incredible. And ones to watch him bowl, I think I bought on the second week, never sold him. It was absolutely incredible. So, I'm going to try buy more ones to watch players this year and also to do more squad builders around them because the, they just look like they're going to be even bigger and better this year. Lacazette's got a nice one at Arsenal with 86 pace, 83 shooting and 85 dribbling. Obviously, that's just his base card, but it will get upgraded as he gets these informs and man of the matches, which hopefully he will at Arsenal. Hopefully, he's not a bit of um, a disappointment. So far, he's played very well. He did get um, a goal against Leicester City, which was unfortunate for us. And he, he's played well when Arsene Wenger's decided to pick him. Douglas Costa's got another one. I don't know why he's... He's on this list. Obviously, he's already been confirmed. But I don't think he's a really big one. Like, I don't think many people will use him at an 82. I think maybe people will start to use him perhaps when he gets informs rated by 85, 86. But for now, I wouldn't use that. 
Bakayoko has been predicted. I think he will get one because he made that move to Chelsea. Quite a big move. Obviously, he was trying to replace Matic there. So, I think he'll get. He'll be obviously more likely to get one than drink water at Chelsea. And think he, he just will. And will he get an inform? That is obviously depending on how well he plays in real life. I can see him maybe getting one inform, but no more really. I don't think he'll get a team of season. Salah. He'll get a team this season. He might even get an inform this week. I think he got a goal against... Who were they playing? I can't even remember who they were playing. But Burnley. Burnley, that's the one. He could even get an inform for the first week of FIFA 18. But Salah's been incredible so far. Picking up the Champions League Player of the Week as well. And it's just been amazing. He's been really, really good. He perhaps should have won Player of the Month in the Premier League. But that did go to the Manchester United player. Was it Martial who got it? I think it was. Or was it Lukaku? Lich Mkhitaryan, I think, got it, actually. But Salah should get a wants-to-watch card. Benjamin Mendy? I, I don't know. Um, if he starts for Man City, he should, though. He's only a 78-rated card. He has really, really not given him the stats I think he deserves. He's a very fast player, so 82 pace is a bit debatable. But, again, I can see him perhaps getting maybe one or two one or two informs he could get a team this season there's not many left backs in the premier league obviously marcus alonso got it last year but there's not many amazing left backs which definitely get it year and year out so perhaps mendy will get it serge aurier a similar one there's not many right backs who get it year in year out so perhaps he could surprise a few people i assume kyle walker's also on this list making that big move to man city but aurier should get one he's got a very nice card already pickford i don't i don't think pickford will get a one swatch card in fifa 18 because goalies never really get informed unless they save a penalty. So, I'd, EA might give him a once to watch card, but I don't think he'll get many informs or a team of the season or anything. Because goalies never really get upgraded too, too much. Hernandez, on the other hand, will get one. He's, he's a goal poacher. He was for Manchester United when he got the chance. He has been for Leverkusen for the last few years. And he's already he started pretty well at West Ham. Getting, is it two or three goals so far in the first four games? So, he's just a poacher. An absolute poacher in front of goal. Like, I can see him getting man of the matches and a few informs to boost this ones to watch card up. So I'm going to try to pick up this ones to watch card this year because Hernandez is just incredible on FIFA year in, year out. So that'd be nice to pick him up. Howard has not really got a lot to say about him. I'm not going to start using a card like this until his pace is a bit better. So I'm not really too bothered about that. Again, Kessie, I'm not really bothered about. Mbappe. Mbappe, he's, he's literally guaranteed. I'm sure he's guaranteed perhaps a team this season and a few upgrades on this wants to watch card. I can see at the end of this FIFA, this being an 89 rated. But that, that is just a big shout for me to say, but I can seriously see him. He's played very, very well in the Champions League and when PSG have been crushing teams so far. So I think Mbappe will get a wants to watch card and make that PSG move permanent. Obviously, he's only on, he's only on loan from Monaco for a season, then PSG have to buy him for... 200 million or something absolutely ridiculous also they combine this summer because financial fair play and they splash the cash on neymar but i can see mbappe getting a few team of a few uh, informs this fifa and perhaps a team of the season tealy man's like again he isn't a slow player ea really hate pace this year it's not a very nice good card at 80 rated but when it gets to 83 84 hopefully ea are generous on the informs like they were last year like instead of getting boosted plus one each time it was plus two plus three plus four sometimes so really really good with their upgrades last year and i think telemans will be one of them brooks i'm not really bothered about there's a lot of better center backs in the league Taliso, if he gets the game time at Bayern munich he should get one like look at these stats on the base card his worst stat being 74 pace that's mad for a centre mid, so I'm going to try and pick this card up if I made a Bundesliga side. And I think Talisa will get a nice ones to watch card. Bruma, will he get one? I'm not too sure about. It's not, not the best card at the moment with only 71 shooting, but it does have 4-star skills, 4-star weak foot. So if he gets a few informs, this ones to watch card could be maybe an 83, 84 rated. Yarmolenko, I'm not really too bothered about. He's got 5-star skills, but only 2-star weak foot, so he's going to be pretty unusable i'm not really sure what foot he actually is but i wouldn't pick up this once to watch card usman dembele on the other hand as i said earlier i had his dortmund once to watch card last year it was just incredible 
He's playing with striker. On seven chemistry, and he was just absolutely phenomenal. Obviously, the five star we've and five star skills, which is retained this year, just makes him so so good. It's a shame that it's a right wing, right mid, and not a left wing. It would be nice to see EA perhaps, if he gets an informed left wing, this position change to a left wing. I don't know if that will annoy some people, but it would be nice to see because he's, he's replacing Neymar, who played on the left. So why give him a right mid sided player? I really am not sure, but I think this card again will be an 88, 89 rated player by the end of FIFA 18, hopefully so. We have Samedo, who made that move from Benfica. Very nice, 92 pace, 80 dribble. I've already reviewed this card in my Barcelona player ratings reactions the other day. Benega, he actually has gone back to Sevilla. I wasn't sure if that had actually happened, but Benega has gone back to his old club. So, will he get a one swatch card? I don't think so. And what is this? Hold on, I'm going to have to zoom out here. Additional possibilities. So, I've got Kalasnach, who I can see getting one. Morata will definitely get one, surely. Michael Keane, I think, would get one. Rooney and Sigurdsson, in my opinion, will get one. And Kyle Walker, definitely. Lindelof, maybe so. Krykoyak, maybe so. Wow, I didn't realise there were all of these players who could get a wants to watch card. How many wants to watch cards are EA going to put in? We've got Nani on here, Rodriguez, Hakan Chanaloglu, a lot of players. We've got Talisa with red out, Sule, Adler, Gnabry. What? What is this? This is mental. Obviously, Usman Dembele was up there, Gabriel. Carlos Backer, I don't know why he's on there twice. Hernandez, there's a lot. A bloody lot of play. Schneider, Schneider gets a one swatch card, that'd be really, really nice. So he's still got his five star weak foot and was has been phenomenal for Netherlands and uh, the last few years. I'd say the last decade. So hopefully he does get one. And Danny Alves as well. That's just gonna be absolutely absolutely sick. And that is all of it. Like Kalasanac has to get one. He's been playing very well for Arsenal, getting a goal in their Champions in their Europa League um, victory the other day. But hopefully you did enjoy this. This was me reacting to Footheads one to watch predictions. You've got all of them right here. So there's a few standout ones like Neymar, Salah, Dembele, James, and Lukaku. I can't wait for. FIFA 18 to drop as I say I get it on the 21st so not too long so stay tuned to my channel for that but thank you guys for watching and see